Hello Kings, Queens, and Royals in between. My name is Joe and this is my channel. And in today's video, I'm going to be recreating uh, a series that I haven't finished because I'm up to that video in my recreating videos thing that I'm doing. What if I skipped priming and skincare? No. What if I skipped skincare and shaving and my makeup process? How would that look at the end? Because I, I did a series a while back that I didn't finish. What if I skipped blank in my makeup process? Long name, I know, I couldn't think of a better one. Where, you know, I skip one step per makeup routine and see how it's different from the rest of my, how my makeup usually looks. As you can see, I did not shave or moisturize in the past few days, but I wouldn't be, I wouldn't, um, you would be okay in guessing that I did do that and it's just been a day. That's usually what happens until I got my special super powerful moisturizer and moisturizing cleanser. I have no excuse for the shaving though. It just hurts. I don't like it. Anyway, last, last year, I think it was a year ago, I did this. Look at this bob. The bob is bobbing. Is the bob bobbing now? Don't answer that. I did this, you know, I'm a little scruffy. Just, you could see a little bit of chin hair. It's hard. I don't know what happened to the picture of it on my Instagram. I guess I deleted it. So I just took a screenshot of my video. And this is the new version. Instead of one gem, it's better gems. And it's two and gr a blue on the bottom. And everything else is basically the same. And also glitter. And also different colored jewelry because I try not to match jewelry with the shirt, with the makeup, with the do 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 too often nowadays until I get to my monochromatic makeup series again, which I also didn't finish. Anyway, that's enough yapping for one day. No, it's not. Uh, let's start now. I probably chose a really bad day to do this because it's so hot outside. 88 degrees Fahrenheit. 91 degrees Fahrenheit. This weather app is right. It does feel like 94. I didn't really have a choice because this is one of my only two days off. And tomorrow, I'm going to be filming next week's video. I was back when I thought that... I don't want to explain it. I don't care. Alright, water. This is probably going to... I don't know. Just sit on top of my dead flaky skin. Such as that. Before I found my super moisturizing moisturizer and super moisturizing cleanser. Thank you, skincare. My skin, even if I did moisturize because I didn't have a very good one for my skin type, would have been extra peely anyway today of all days. Uh, but now that I've figured out how to properly moisturize my scalp, self, skin, it's not as super peely, which is, you know, it's less impressive to my eyes for this kind of series. But then again, I feel like if you saw like what it used to be, you would have been too grossed out to watch the video. So I guess that's sort of a win for me. I wasn't 100% sure if I even wanted to do the series again because I was just gonna move right along, just recreate this look the normal way and then keep it pushing. But I asked in the community uh, tab of YouTube if you guys wanted to see that from me, the an, a redo of the series, and most of y'all said yes. I think it was 91v8, no, 91v9. I don't do math very good. I use a calculator at work. So many things are 50% off nowadays. Not enough shelf, too much product. You guys know how. I'm wearing the same shirt as a year ago. Do you guys, you guys still like it? I don't have a green striped shirt, unfortunately. Um, also, it's so hot in here that I only have two, three buttons and then the rest is open, so. Sun's out, belly out, as they say. I know that's not what they say. They say something about butt cheeks. All right, that's feeling really nasty. Time to move on. Usually I do a fun gimmick as I work up to the base if you're new, but I can't think of anything right now, so I'm just gonna do it and, you know. That's pretty much it, I don't know what I was gonna. I know a year later, ew, skin flakes. <laughs> How's that happen? I know a year later, I'm going to be more fuzzy in the beard area. This is the per time period in my life where I'm going to be 
hairy easier if I don't figure out how to wax my face or my body. If I just shave, I will be, uh, my, my hair will grow back thicker. And that's sort of how it works when you shave anyway, but specifically for my age range, that's how it works either way. Unfortunately, I don't want it. This um, skin situation is, I don't even think it's as bad as it was in one of my other videos not too long ago. I always do this. I always open up Instagram and then get distracted by all the videos. I thought as soon as I laid eyes on it, I would remember which one it was. I'm trying, you, you guys, you know, you guys know I'm trying. My name is Grandma. My name is Grandma. Maybe it's the shortest makeup tutorial I'm ever Kings, Queens, and Royals in between. Okay, I don't care that much anymore. I was just trying to be factual. I was trying to add to the lore of the um, the cinematic universe. This video feels like it's 30 million minutes long. I've learned how to stop lap lap. Bleh. I've learned how to stop yapping. I've learned how to lap lap break. I've learned how to yap less is what I'm trying to say. I'm not gonna do too much um, powdering. I don't know. I feel like it's gonna peel off with the way my skin is right now. So slightly less powder than the normal amount. Also, my top lip is wet from sweat. You guys, why do I keep- This is what the skin looks like right now. I don't know what this is. I think that's one of the flakes that fell down. Content warning for eczema, I guess. Setting spray time. Watermelon. There's so many water droplets in the air. It looks like H2O just to add water. I'm no ordinary girl. Ew. That's that mean Nintendo. $400. Raw. Curtis Connor. Why is everything so much money? Okay, so this is the base before the highlighting, the bronzing, and the contouring and the blushing. Did I just take that off? I just, I just wanted to, Ew. I just wanted to scratch my forehead. It itches because it's hot out. Highlighter to even on dry, disgusting skin, it looks good. Thank you, I Heart Revolution, Revolution, Makeup Revolution. Makeup. This is my skin really dry. <laughs> you know that. But also, like, the foundation and powder and, you know, the concealer is all dried down, too. This is just the product performing by itself. It doesn't have any like wet foundation to grab onto. Thank goodness for that. You know what I mean. Other than right here, cause my sweaty upper lip. My sweat stash, sorry. Keep going in circular motions because stabbing my face with this brush feels really good. It's getting my itch. There are rats in this room and they're just poop pooping it up. Like that unicorn toy. My poop, my poop, my poop, my poop. What was that you guys? I don't think kids are actually obsessed, obsessed with poop that much. Do they really find it that funny? Any uh uh any parents in the in the chat in the comments below? Comment below. This is what it looks like with highlighter on it. Textured, dry, thanking the Lord above or whoever exists above for moisturizer. I'm trying to convince my best friend not to spend four hundred dollars on Curtis Connor tickets because he's finally in our state, performing in our state. Maybe that's what he wanted all along. All of our money. That's why he waited. Curtis, I know what you're doing. So I'm seeing a little bit of trouble grabbing onto my skin with this bronzer. Usually it's way more pigmented on the first application, but I have to do a little bit more of this, which is fine. Luckily for me, this isn't what my skin looks like anymore. This isn't how my skin performs anymore. Starting when this video is over. Looking texture for a blush. I'm gonna do a peachy color. I don't even know if I have that color anywhere, but I want. I think I'm gonna do Clever from the Looney Tunes I Heart Revolution palette. That's all, folks. That's so funny. Just one of those things. It's not the worst my skin has ever looked. There was a moment. What? Let's see if I can still find it. If I zoomed in, you would be able to tell. And this picture. My my eyelids were really bad and it hurt so much to put makeup on. I'm trying to think of it, why did I put makeup on when my skin was looking bad? Probably because I want to be internet famous and to have money. Anyways, with that being said, I'm going to be doing both brows and one eye off camera and I'll be right back. 
All right, I did both brows and one eye off camera and I feel very itchy. I did my brows slightly thinner and lower on the face because my eyebrow hairs are growing in mostly right here. So added on to that. Much like in the last time I did this, I did it lower and thinner, I think. Also my classic brown eyeliner on the forehead technique doesn't really work on sandpaper. The glitter stuck to underneath the eye. I don't know if that is indicative any of anything. It's just something that I noticed. Also the glitter. Off camera, it looks a little patchy and like you can see the eyelid underneath, but on camera, it looks fine. So that's what I, oh, I forgot to do the gems. I think I need to deepen that blue that's underneath the eye and add it back in like right there, you know. You guys know. I'm not feeling these blue gems anymore. I think I want to do a yellow. No! I'll do orange. Time to do it. Just kidding. On this side. So I used the Pretty All Set 3-in-1 Face and Eyeshadow Palette by You Can Be. Open the door. And I used this lime green as a start. And then with a, a, a more packer kind of brush. The same shade. Just like on the eye and then gradiate out into that softer part. That way it appears more pigmented, I guess. <laughs> I don't know, it looks good. Now I'm gonna do this bold blue color. Never used it before. First impressions. And I'm just gonna, you know, just swipe it on to the underneath of the eye. Now the lighter blue, never used it before. Oh, that's too much. Oh no, how can I be a model in these conditions? Now as like a nothing gold color before the glitter, I'm just gonna do one of these from the warming up section. Now for the glitter, I'm using a nail glitter. Don't do this. Please use an eye safe glitter if you're gonna do this. I'm not legally responsible for what happens to you if you do do this because I'm telling you to use an eye safe glitter. Thank you so much. The eyelids are very unpredictable for me. One day it could be the smoothest, most hydrated eyelids you've ever seen and felt before in your life. Please don't feel my eyelids if you ever meet me, thank you. And the other day it could be Peely McGee. I don't know how to describe it. And it's not something that can go away. Doctors have said to other people, I'm scared to go to the doctor. It's just something I have to deal with. I can have temporary relief with my moisturizer and cleanser, you know. It's just very interesting. That's why I wanted to do this series. Also to, I'm kind of obsessed with like the idea of alternate universes and things being slightly different. I don't know what that has to do with makeup. What would I look like if I didn't use foundation, but I use the rest of the makeup, you know what I mean? Gem time. I'm using these ones again. Turn your brain off for me. I was a bad girl. I did some bad things. I don't know why leaning makes a mascara easier to put on. Okay. Last time. I think the last time I did this wore these lashes was the pink pink and gold eyeshadow. Cause you see, cause you see there's gold glitter on. Am I gonna clean that off? No. It adds to the look. Glitter lashes, glitter. Have you seen those on Amazon on Wish? Glitter. <clears throat> I feel like it looks better on the outside. Thank you for your input, Project Runway Tim Gunn. Designers. Make it work. Oh, they look different because they are different. I made them. Sounds like a monologue about creating a monster. A monster lash. Oh, I'm knocking things over. I don't like that. Me at work recovering things from the shelves, pulling them to the front, knocking them over. It's not fun. Time for lips. I think I'm actually gonna wear lipstick this time. It's crazy, right? That was my impression of that Megan girl. I don't know, I've never seen that movie. What's going on here? What happened? Matt Magenta from the Clinique Labs. This one is also Clinique, but it says Clinique on the tube. This one does not. Don't ask me questions I don't know the answer to, I will cry. Look how smooth. I miss wearing lipstick on my mouth. I would wear lipstick on my mouth if it was, if I had a yellow one or a green one or a blue one. Peachy gloss. 
That is yummy. I look good today. Despite my affliction. Does this beard bother you? Does this skin flake bo- Do these skin flakes bother you? You need to look inward. I'm just kidding. It's okay to be disgusted by my skin condition. But to a certain point. Now I'm going to brush my bang and I'll be right back. I forgot I was doing a pink lip today and I grabbed pink jewelry. I might have to change that. Oh, I'm done. You can barely tell I have eczema, but you can tell that I have a beard. And it is purple. And like I said, I'm changing the jewelry. I'm gonna do this purple and blue. That's what it sounds like when I try to whistle. Thank you. Hey, I should go on America's Got Talent. I'm just kidding, I don't like that show. It's, it gives me the ick. All right, this is the finished look. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you enjoyed the process that it took to get here. I feel pretty good. I like this look and everything it stands for. This is a fun little experiment. I hope you can follow along. Uh, I hope you want to follow along with me as I do the other ones. I'm going to look basically the same, just slightly different for one reason or another. That's what I found in all the other videos that I did. Still didn't finish that series. If you want to like, like. If you want to comment, comment. If you want to subscribe, subscribe. If you want to share, you should share. If you want to send me money on Cash App, jailmore684. And if you don't want to do any of those things, but if you, or if you want to do some of those things, but other, or not others, that's completely fine. Uh, and with that, I will see you next time. Bye, y'all.